What's up, B-Share fam, and welcome back to my channel. And um, this is the music video I've been waiting for for a few weeks. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, uh, then you don't know how much I adore J.B. Miller. Um, I've reacted to his music videos for over a year, and... Um, Every song has hit me in a different spot in my heart, and this one in particular. Um, I have a story that I will share at the end. Um, but I want to go ahead and tell you guys that I'm reacting to Jamie Miller's new song, MV for Empty Room. Um, you guys know that uh, I'm a very emotional person, and if I cry, you've already expected it so um just a warning that it may be more emotional than any video I've ever done and again I'll share that at the end so here's my reaction to Empty Room by Debbie Miller oh god Got all the time in the world until you don't. I was better known forever, but forever comes and goes. Never thought I had to know you as a memory. Now I'm rehearsing all the things I say if you were in front of me. I'll tell you that I love you, I miss you, I wish you were here. Maybe if I shout it loud enough, you might hear I'll talk to the world, I'll tell them the truth Ever heart to heart with the ceiling, cause I can't with you I got all this love, but what good does it do If I'm all alone, so I'll scream to this empty room Hoping it'll get to God, I can feel his pain. I think I heard the curtains whispering your name. That is my favorite line. I listen to the song. And I don't know if it's hell. And this one did. But I don't think I can help it. Cause there's a million things I didn't get to say. Like how much I love you, I miss you, I wish you were here. Jamie is. 
you guys should go look him up. This song he wrote because he didn't get to say goodbye to his grandmother who was his best friend. She passed away before he could say goodbye. I have, I have a strong connection with this song. I knew that one day Jamie would get me, like get me, get me, like emotionally just trigger my heart. I didn't get to say goodbye to my dad. I didn't get to say goodbye. And that broke my heart. And I've held in this pain for two years. I have not grieved at all because I had to be the strong one. And I had to hold myself together because if I fell apart, everyone else would fall apart. The other night, the other night when the song premiered, it was the first time in two years that I actually grieved my dad's death. I sobbed for four hours, listening to this song repeatedly, because it is everything I said to myself for two years. Everything I felt for two years. I had gone live on TikTok that night. I was listening to it for the first time and I lost it uncontrollably cry could not stop and God bless Jamie he came in there and he saw me crying and he's he's like oh no he's like I love you and I was like I love you too Jamie's one of the sweetest artists I have ever been able to meet. I'm hoping in the fall I'll get to meet him in person, but I have never been this emotionally connected to an artist before. Finally helping me grieve. For finally letting go of this pain that I've held for two years. For breaking down that wall that I needed broken. And to show that it is okay to let go. It is okay to let go. <sighs> if anyone out there is dealing with this too, you are not alone. You are not alone. Go stream Jamie's new song on Spotify or download it on iTunes or watch it on YouTube in the links down below. If you need healing, this song will heal you. I love you guys.